Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to build a custom page using the page builder that we have in the conversion team. Um, right now, by default, I have one, two, three page custom template. I also have the contact, the normal page, the narrow page, or the page sidebar. I'm going to focus with page custom one. If I create another page for about us, I will page at custom two and another page for story page at custom three and in or a fake you can see how you can add more page dot custom four five six and then you build your whole store with our page builder so right now I have nothing here I'm gonna just add a few text uh, whatever I say here I'm gonna also add an image um, let's put this because I like it and I have no idea how big it is well let's put it grand grand okay so I'm gonna save this right now I go in custom page and I will see the section that I just created well normally uh, showing up here okay so I'm gonna click on the page constructor and right now my column width is a hundred percent and it's showing what I have in my page right now well until then this is normal I can show the page title or not um, I'm gonna show it and I can uh, just make it narrower or wide here is what where the magic happens and here so I'm going to start from top to bottom. I'm going to create a column width of 50%. And the custom content that I added right there is added at the right of uh, this current section. So this way I can build multiple different, uh, <laughs> different stuff. I can also like go here and not use this at all and click save and just use the custom content that I have right there. The reason why we built this is now you have 100% flexibility over the whole page and you can put whatever you want uh, in it. So right now I'm gonna just stick with it. I'm gonna build a narrow page and 100% and voila! We have something that looks pretty nice and that has a really easy to understand uh, process uh, so for example I'm gonna make this bigger and well the image itself is not bigger but uh, the reason why this is uh, useful is because if I put this a little bigger then boom voila we have a bigger image could also put this like full width and then these drops below so you have to understand uh, the grid from 100% to 20%. This is five columns. This is four columns. This is th three columns. This is two columns. I'm going to stick it with 50%. And here I have a block of text with a button with a link to products. And if I change this, well, automatically the other block goes below. And if I put 20%, then it goes right next to it the same process for this if I go above 20% because I already have 50 25 and if I go above then it drops below so this follow the logics and I can also align differently the text as well as the title and then I could do like some fancy stuff I could add a menu I could add a block of text an image a button and I mean this is really really powerful if you want to build whatever you want to build in the custom page so this is it it's almost uh, been uh, four uh, minute 30 and uh, well you can test it out by yourself and see how far you can go with customization uh, with the page builder for Shopify